Hello, Heartfelt families. It's me, Miss Tanya, and for today's activity, we're going to be making stress balls. For this activity, you're going to need some conditioner, any kind is fine, a half a measuring cup, and one cup. You're also going to need baking soda, and obviously, balloons. I picked little smiley face balloons. Okay. So in a bowl, you're going to take two cups of the baking soda and dump it right in. Now I went ahead and made it ahead of time. And then you're gonna take a half a cup of our conditioner. And you're gonna mix it around for a little bit until you get this consistency. It's kind of smushy. You can almost tell it feels like the end of a, the inside of a stress ball. Now this would be fun with the kids because they can touch it using their senses and feel how it feels. Now the next step is you're going to take a bottle and you're going to make your own funnel. I just cut the top off of a water bottle. Grab your balloon. You're going to open it up a little bit. And you're going to put it on top of this, like so. Okay, once you got that situated like this, grab a spoon and go ahead and start filling your balloon. Now this is the fun, messy part. You get to push it down in there and see it come down. Look at that. Feels pretty cold, too. It smells good. It smells like the waterfall mist of the conditioner I picked out. If you need help coaxing it down, just pinch it a little bit and give it a shake. Push some more down. You'll see you get a little messy. Now you're gonna fill it up as much as possible. You can, and if you don't wanna get your fingers dirty, you can always scrape it and then push it down with the end of the spoon. Or you can find something else to push it down with. Maybe the popsicle sticks. Let's see if I have one. Yeah, we have a popsicle stick right here. Let's go ahead and push it right on down. Now what's fun about this activity is not only are your kids using their senses, but they're using their fine motor skills to stir this. And let me tell you, it's a little tough once it starts to get to this consistency. All right, let's keep filling up this balloon. Now this probably makes about six or seven of them. So if you wanna make them for your friends, you can always send them to your friends. It's a really good teacher gift. <laughs> this is so much fun. I might actually do this with my nephews. All right. So as you can tell, we're almost getting full. So once you get to that point, give it a little shake. It looks like we might be able to put a little bit more in. Let's try one more handful scoop. Okay, now we got most of that full. We're gonna go ahead and take the balloon off. Now this is a tricky part. This is where the parents probably have to come in and do it. Give it a little shake and then take the balloon and tie it shut. And voila, you have a stress ball. Now, if you don't want to use the smiley face balloons, you can get regular plain balloons and you can use um, markers on it and draw pictures. Um, I suggest using the whiteboard markers because if you use permanent marker, it, after a while it'll wipe off. I hope you guys enjoy this activity, and I hope you guys enjoy doing it at home. We all miss you here at Heartfelt, and I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.